Hello everybody. Today I'm going to go ahead and show you some very basic uh, xcopy commands. Alright, so the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and navigate to the desktop. So do cd desktop. There we go. And if we do dir, we see that we do see the test folder. So what we're going to do is let's go ahead and grab everything that we have in the test folder and let's move it to the documents. So we'll do x copy, we'll do test, and let's go right ahead and do c. I'll do users, of course the username. We'll do documents. We're gonna get hit enter, and as you can see, we do have uh, the twenty nineteen. A documents folder as well as a text file and a PDF. So let's go right ahead and see what we see in documents, which would be right here. And there we go. So, um, yeah, that's uh, the first command on how to move documents from the desktop, let's say, to the documents folder. All right, so the next command that we're going to be doing is we're going to go ahead and do the X command. But instead of go, uh, moving something to documents, I actually want to move it to a flash drive or a hard drive. So on the, in this instance, I'm going to go ahead and move it to uh, a, a USB flash drive. So I already went right ahead and created a folder here, which would um, which is called Ramo. So let's see what happens once uh, this runs. So the command is x oops copy course test. And we're gonna do f and Ramo. Hit enter, and there we go. As you can see, we do have all three folders or files uh, that got copied to the flash drive. So the next thing we want to do is I'm going to go right ahead and do the X command, but I want to go right ahead and move everything, or not move everything, but copy the files from the test folder into a network drive. So the network drive that we're going to be using is this R drive. It's already mapped. And you do see that there's a couple of more folders in here, but where we're going to be um, copying everything is going to be in the X copy Ramo. So I'm already in there. So the command that you're going to be running is x copy, and of course the folder, which would be test. And here we're just basically going to go ahead and redirect it to drive letter R. So it would be R, R, and we're going to do x copy and ramo, and hit enter, and there we go. We have everything that we had on our desktop now moved to our shared folder. So the next command that I'm going to be showing you is how to move uh, folders that are inside of, let's just say, you know, like this, this test folder. You know, we're here in the desktop, we have the test folder, and we have an empty folder here. So if we go in there, there's nothing in there, but you just want to go right ahead and grab everything, even if it's even if it's empty. So the command that you'll be using is x oops, copy. It will be option E. And we'll do the same thing, test. And let's go right ahead and just move it to the documents. So we'll do C users and documents. Hit enter. And there we go. So you see that the empty folder got moved as well. Now, let's just say, you know, we're just going to go ahead and delete it. And let's see what happens if we just just run the regular x command, just so you see. So we run the x command. And there it is. So you see that, I mean, even though the folder is still there and it's empty, it's not going to get transferred. The next command that we're going to be running is, uh, let's just say we want to copy certain files that, that were created after a certain date. So this is a perfect example. You can see that these two folders, or files, I should say, were created today. But you do see that there's this PDF that was last modified on November 16, 2011. 
So let's just say we just want to copy anything after 2012. So the command that we'll use is x copy forward slash d colon. And we're going to do January the 1st, 2012. And this is going to be applied on the test folder. And let's move it to the flash drive. So we'll do f, drive letter f, and we'll do ramo. And actually, I'm actually in the wrong directory. So let's let's uh, let's move to the f directory. Now let's go into the folder. So there we go. So let's hit enter. And as you can see, everything got moved except the PDF. So we specified. You know, anything after January the 1st, 2012, let's go ahead and copy it. So, uh, yeah, there we go. There's uh, another uh, X copy command. And uh, just like always, I really do hope you enjoy these videos, and we'll catch you on the next one.